Hello everyone and welcome to the third match of FWE episode 9 And our next match is a COC tournament match Which is a match between Team 1 and Team 4 Team 1 is Matthew and Eric Ty While they verse Team 4 which comprises of Danny Mercury and Mainstream And this match is next and our first competitor, he is Matthew, the man, and he is representing Team 1. And here comes his partner, also representing Team 1, he is Eric, the troublemaker, Ty. Too much is not enough, nobody said this stuff makes any sense, we hooked again, the point of no return, see how the buildings burn, light up the night, such a pretty sight. opponents representing team four he is Danny the legend breaker Mercury And our second member for Team 4, he is the main stream. And here we go, Team 2 going up against Team 4, Matthew the Man going up against the Legend Breaker, Danny Mercury. Now, this should be a magnificent match, Eric Ty and Danny Mercury, I mean Matthew, sorry. Eric Ty and Matthew the Man teaming up 
2 vs Danny Mercury in mainstream with a lot of um, actual there's an actual I would say a rivalry between Danny Mercury and the mainstream they're at one point trying to fight for the number one contendership of the international championship Danny Mercury actually won that match and got very 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 close to winning the championship at Legacy against Jason McGrady who is also on team 4 which is quite a surprise and good backdrop there by Danny Mercury onto the back now Matthew the man what is this move great move there by Matthew the man Punch of the arm, Danny Mercury. Elbow to the face of Danny Mercury once again. Now it's getting me into a headlock. Now off the arm of Danny Mercury. Looking to reverse it. Yes, he will. Onto the back of Matthew the Man. And oh! Just planting him on the face. And throws him into the corner. Looking for a tag. Now get a little bit suspicious about the tag teamwork between Danny Mercury and Mainstream it's going to be a little bit confusing for the both of them considering how they are and maybe looking for a suplex off the top rope yes he will great move there doing a super 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 suplex <laughs> I'm, I'm actually not even sure what it's called super suplex off the top rope and great angle slam there or oh, Olympic slam I would say by Danny Mercury there's a clothesline, reversing the leg from the kick. And so far, we've had two matches for the night of COC. And so far, we have team. Um, let me have a little look. Team three is currently actually no. Whoa, 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 whoa. I said that wrong. <laughs> team two is currently in the lead after winning the tag team match which gained them three points one behind um, one point in front of team um, team three which had Jeremy Stone winning the match um, early on during the night so whoever wins this could quite sum it up because um, actually wait both Team 1 and Team 4 have yet to... Go Actually, wait, no. Wait, I said that wrong. No, team 1 has competed yet. I mean, competed. But um, they lost, sadly. So maybe Eric Ty and Matthew the Man can put them back in the running of the match with three points. And if Danny Mercury and uh, Mainstream win... Oh, my God, my freaking controller. Um, Danny Mercury and Mainstream win, they could have a good lead and lead up to the match between Jason McGrady and um, Mike Hero. And great move there by Danny Mercury. So far, great match so far between these two. Ooh, quick lick takedown there by Matthew the Man to Danny Mercury. Maybe Danny Mercury might look for a tag. But yet again, into a lockup. Matthew the Man wins this one. He looks just for that slam. Yes, he does. Elbow drop. Does a little damage. You have yet to tag in this match so far. On the back is Danny Mercury of Matthew the Man. Yet again, planting the face of Matthew the Man onto the ground. Yet again, headlock. Just elbow to the face. Danny Mercury. Elbows once again, reversal. A lot of elbow reversals. And whoo, Danny Mercury looking to assist his teammate, which is needed. Just a knee to the stomach. Danny Mercury working on Matthew the Man at the moment. Turns him around, throws him into the corner, maybe looking for a tag here. Yes, he will. Mainstream is the first competitor to be tagged in this match. And looks like Matthew the Man doesn't want in. Eric Ty going up against Mainstream. Here we go. Headlock here by Eric Ty. The Mainstream takes him down quickly. Lifts him up. Yet again. Ooh. And again, the experience of Eric Ty overwhelms every single one of them in the ring. He was one of the first competitors to join the FWE and 
was actually a contender for the World Championship at the Legacy, but sadly lost. And updating everyone, the World Championship match will be on tonight between Victor and the awesome one. Victor will be um, claiming in his rematch clause against awesome one tonight in which should be a fantastic match it will clearly show who deserves to be the champion awesome one and victor have had a long going rivalry that has just overwhelmed every single thing as last it actually has gone on since the beginning of f oh well the f like the first or second week of fwe when they competed against each other during a tournament for the um FWE World Champion, Awesome One sadly lost it, but then Awesome One went on to win the Elimination Chamber, which um, allowed him to have a number one contendership at Legacy to verse Victor, which turned into a triple threat match um, when Eric Ty won the Beat the Clock Challenge against Victor to place himself in that match. Good takedown there by Matthew the Man. And it's gone on from there. Awesome one then won at Legacy in that 20 minute Iron Man match, triple threat match, which has never ever happened in the history of um, WWE. I don't think so. I've never seen it, nor in TNA, I'm not sure. <laughs> but that was a fantastic match. Only one pinfall was made though, which was the awesome one, which allowed him to win the World Championship. Eric Ty back in against Danny Mercury. Sort of went away from the subject. But it's one of the best rivalries I think so far in FWE is the rivalry between Eric Ty, the awesome one, and Victor has just gone on since the beginning of the FWE and will probably continue to the end of the FWE. And quickly punches Eric Ty out the ring. Eric Ty back into the ring. Maybe Main Street, maybe looking for a tag. It's that headlock. It's a knee to the stomach. Ooh. Good God, that would hurt. It's a knee to the kick to the stomach now. Now Eric Ty off the arm of Main Street into that headlock. And maybe looking for something here. And ooh. Good move there by Eric Ty. Wonderful as always. And mainstream looking for something good here. Ooh, turns that suplex into a front. Um, inverted suplex, great move there. Now just that leg sweep takedown. Now Eric Tauf, the arm just ooh, throws it down. Just punches once again. Ooh, looking for that um, kick. Misses into a Hurricane Rana. Good move there by mainstream. He's taller than Eric Ty as well, doing a move like that to him. <laughs> and what's this? Oh, just throws him over the shoulders. Great move there by Eric Ty. The vintage Eric Ty, I would say. We usually see that on him. And oh, skull crushing finale. Great move there. And uh oh, might look for the gory bomb. Eric Ty's finishing move and gets it. Mainstream, not in a good position here. Drags him to the middle of the ring. Danny Mercury needs to help out right now. Pin for one. Two. Ooh, good teamwork there by Danny Mercury to come into that. And so with Matthew the Man and everybody's in the ring. But quickly, the referee um, stops everyone from getting in the ring. And Mainstream and Eric Ty are back to.